We're going to plug right inside of the crevice here if we can. I don't know if this has cannons or not. I think this one, I think most islands do. And usually in the front portion anyway. I don't think there'll be any over here, but... It might not. It might have to park over there on that side, but... I can... You can normally go and kill off the guy in the cannon. Make sure that we don't see any boats, anything nearby. Have a picture that's not even a boat coming up. I don't think there will be. I think we're right on the perfect side. Make sure there's nothing nearby that could be a threat. Just, uh, you gotta always be aware of your surroundings, dude. Like, you gotta learn that, and eventually you will get better at it, and you will be better and alert. Because I've said this before, it's not just about all. Oh, Get, get a gun going on an island now. Oh my god, dude. Dude, I think we might have got something that might be worth a pretty- Oh my god, have we got something down there? Yeah, we're gonna go see. We might just go sell this stuff and come back. If we get any more, like, valuables, I don't know if it's worth risking everything. If, something, if we get anything down there, it's like, oh my god, yeah, we're gonna probably come back. Dude. Dude, this this right here was probably our biggest, biggest haul, like, tonight, and I think we need to be a very extra careful with what we're doing. If we can knock out these captains, yeah, I'm down for it, but I'm not going to risk everything to do this and lose a pretty good, substantial of dashings. That's why I say to like Gold Hoarder, you find a lot more of that. Just making sure. We'll park that on the back side, but there could be somebody who comes around the back side. You have to go get this stuff knocked out, boys. We could go do this. Yeah, I just want to make sure that we don't get anybody golden sands. That's the hard thing, is once you get it. Get up on the top side. I think that I don't... Let's go and take a look here real quick. Uh, with uh, anything over here. Nope, I think we're good. I'm going to buy a boat, but... A boat, like I said too. Yeah, you gotta be a wimp, but it ain't like you just can't go and back up and go. It's not it's not like a speedboat. You're talking about the Pony Express here. Okay, we gotta go and I go get all the light. We're gonna go work on one at a time, I think, right now. If we don't get any gold ones, then we're good.
Yep, and, but the thing is that they don't get damaged. Well, they might. No, they have to have light to get damaged. Yep. And that, see, and it also, you want to make sure that you're by, that you're close to your boat. See, I don't like to always be spotted here too, but they're making like, oh, that, that there might be the crack and they might have good loot. That's why too, that you always want to be aware of like, once again, who in the lobby here. That too. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of nice pirates, but you always gotta be like aware. I know that it's like, it's a game that you just gotta constantly be like alert, be making sure that you know what you're dealing with. But I'm on the back side, so if anything, they're not going to see this side of the island. They're trying to see if there's a way to get up there from here. No, I don't think there is. It's okay. Why at night I don't have ever do I do I do I do I put lights on my ship? That's a that's a no no. That's like one of the big things you never do. Uh, if 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 you do, and you get but most of those ships they have the lights on. No, and number one, if you come you, you that it, it depends. But I normally always put take the lights. Yeah, I think I uh, blow them up. There's another, there's another one. I can't help it with those. That's why I say that those there are like creepers. When they come, you're dead. Whew. I don't know what's going on. I, got I like the light for the Kraken thing too. I think the Kraken one's really unique for for a thing, but that might not be the Kraken one. I think it is. Is that the Kraken one? Oh, it is. It might be the Kraken one. Okay, we look at it now. Now we got daylight. We got a little bit more of where they can see. Got to make sure that we don't got anybody over there. Be a little bit more to where we're surrounding. Just do the little, the little check. If you do, if if you do things like this. You should have no problem, usually. If you come across a player that's shooting you, well, you're gonna come across pl players. I mean, I mean, once again, you could check, but then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, a chef could be coming with the wind and, and get you and knock you out pretty, pretty stone cold. I think it should be good if we can get these guys without blowing up the TNTs. Normally, these uh, bosses don't take that long to kill. But I got I gotta keep moving in here, and I don't want to be timed out. But I will be mad if I time out. I'm not timing out. That's why I gotta keep moving my my mouse. If I if, if I do have an intermission, it could be probably for like three minutes to deal with something. But why is that guy still there? Well, we can't. But I gotta kill the. Yeah, because I can't keep dealing with the TNT scrubs. Oh god. That's the thing. I keep getting TNT guys spawning. I'm never going to be able to ever get that done. Did I eat the banana? See, that's what I mean. It's not me being solo, it's me getting TNT killed. And when they spawn in, the TNT has a certain amount of seconds before it goes off. And you keep doing that. I, I don't know if there could be one there always that spawns in the killing one. But if like, I, usually there's not. We'll see. 
I like the game a lot, so I don't mind. It's, it's all a part of the game. Looking, I mean, yeah. Uh, see, if you're on that side, you'd have a lot more open. At least over here, people don't go. I just park, and you gotta park smart too. When you're parking on a nine, it could be there for a while. You don't wanna park. You wanna park smart. But if you're gonna be on a line that can be a short like oh you're going in there and you're done, then yeah I could go and park somewhere just to get on it and get it and go. But if you're gonna be there a while like I am, you wanna park smokes and then when you're not you're not gonna get spotted that easily. Because of reasons. You know, you wanna you wanna just play smart. Play smart. That that's that it it ain't just like you gotta go and do your things, you know. I think we might be getting to the captain soon. Oh, gold one. We can get right by these and blow up. We got two of them in there. We should have gotten the other one. I believe, I think they're thinking Bell is on the other side of the island. It is, it's way up top. I mean, I could bring them over there, but I think I should be able to get them next time. See, that's right, I should have tried to group them all up first. And then use that TNT Bell on them. That's what you try to do, you try to play that way too. You kind of learn a little, a little bit of the tool and trade about doing, dealing with these type of quests. And then with the end, you should be fine. If, 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 you, if you have trouble with this stuff like that, you just gotta just learn how to play and how to do all of the soul quests. You can use the itch one on if it's a big island, but it's like a medium size, so that might not be too too well uh, casing spots. Anyways, I get him. Okay, let's see what else is here. It might be. I just blew up a whole bunch, and I know I had a sacrifice, but that might have been the better, the better plan. Well, I was low on health anyways too, but sometimes you sacrifice, and then you come back right back, and then you're going to the captain wave. Now we got, how many of these do we got to do on here? Three of them. Then we're going to go buy another, another two more quests, but that's not fun of this route. Usually stream go two different ways. We start off bad and off on a good note, or start off good and end up on a bad note. Because we got exactly three more hours left of, uh, three more hours. We'll be going for four hour stream. If we go to 130, I'll be an hour and four hours and 30. I mean, that. If you guys don't already know, I never put my stuff in the map area because I don't like people peeking through. But once we get on the island, I kind of get them a little bit more better if we can. I just don't know what type of guys we're dealing with next. If it's gonna be those, uh, whatever gold ones, I'll bring them over there to the other side of the, uh, to the other side of the island. They gotta just play smart. All I gotta do, guys. Smart, you just gotta, you just gotta, you just gotta, like, you, you, you just sense a little bit. You, you use your bell gun on two different types of things. You use them on TNT guys, or you use them on no gold on a gold one. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see what type we get. It may, it may be one captain that spawns, or it might be all three at once. 
Oh, it don't look like it. It looks like we got the gold, guys. So what I'm going to do... I'm going to go do this. Oh, it's all of them? So my plan is to bring them all, oh, to bring them all up over here. Follow me, guys. Follow me. We're going to Congo line them up. Is it a new trick I'd have thought of? If you need to, you just lure them all down. If they're not, they're not wanting to Congo mine. That's other guy hit a little bit too slow. Well, you know what? What come to work if I don't get them all? Congoing? Let's get this other captain here getting in, getting in the mix too. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and uh, fucking get right up here and get and get them, get them all grouped up. Then we're gonna Congo line them. Let's see that line over there. No, it looks like a good, looks like a good run. Come on, buddies. We're Congoing. Come on, buds. Over here to you, over here to you, that's the key. You know, you, you could be a low invasion lane, like I said, and you could be on most top of everything, but then, uh... See what I did, I got them all clumped together. You want to bring them up here. I think that they're all gonna follow. Or we should follow. If they don't, I can bring them up there now. Come on, buddies. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, no, the captain. The captain didn't follow. So now we got them. We got them right up here. We could just go and execute them off. Good tonight, turning it and stuff. Oh, God, that's cool. Good payout today, boys.
God, it takes forever. Look at the amount of bullets they are taking. Maybe because I'm not to get them. Yeah, you'll be dead soon with your buddies. Look at that, this is brilliant because you congo them up to the shooting gallery. Oh my god, so we got a uh, danger. Okay, we gotta go take this, uh... You gotta take them over. That that the that the hard part now. Getting them over there. I'm gonna go grab myself some bananas, and we're gonna we're gonna go cash all this in. Go get a nice little payout today. At least get the Bellinus skull. So what you get is you always get the, the valuable stuff first. In case something ever happens, goes down, and then like you gotta abandon the island, at least you got the valuable stuff off first. That's that's also a little key, a little a little trick to the wise. Never you never you never go and get the never go and get the uh, other stuff first. Wait, can we get up? Can we get up here? Maybe. Oh, no, we, oh wait, we might be able to go up this way. I was trying to see if there's a way to throw these down here. I haven't been able to be successful with that yet, so... Uh, if we could get that done, that, that would be awesome. Well, better than nothing. Actually, it did save a little bit of time. Probably not much. Considering, but if you can just, if I can get them, oh wait, I can get them down there, definitely. You know what? We're gonna get them down there, and then we'll go down there and go. We don't have to go far then. Okay, yeah, we could do that, definitely. Okay, so yeah, we got the last call. We're gonna go. I'm gonna go double check that island real quick. It looks okay now. Doesn't mean it'll be okay when we go there because what? You, because what? Because what you see now is gonna be different than what you see a little bit later. Uh, we gotta get these on there now. I'm not now later now. Alright, so we're gonna probably get off first. We're gonna have to park right by the... I, I think Golden Sand is really good for this. Uh, let's just double check the map too. In case we don't get anybody, any like PvP ships or anything. Uh, let's double check the map. Do my little... I'm not gonna go quick scan. But it looks like we might have a pretty good shot today of Golden Sands. Uh, that's to the northwest. So what we're gonna have to do is... Oh, I could have did a sword lunge. That might have been the greatest thing to do. Sword lunging over there. I would have gotten on the back and sword lunge. So we need to get the wheel doing like a, a 90. And then we got to go turn out. If we need like a low level one. But I'm going to get rid of Polly. Polly will go off and do the... the, the uh, that the heads I want to get that other trinket off but I don't I've never seen one of those a sold one and those you've 
See, you can find a lot underneath the water. Yes, you can. Okay, we gotta go and get this ready for, for the poacher. Good job, boys.